All right, my friends, we got some breaking news. i9, 9th gen processors are here for the mobile. And we're gonna be going through the marketing material <laughs> review. So now, as you can see, we got MKB front covering the i9 on the 9th gen. Look at that H series mobile processor. It's got eight cores. Previously, we only had the gamers. And they were introducing the first ever i9 mobile processor. But if you scroll down a little bit, you can see that these guys are now gaming on a whole new level. But if you scroll down on the 8th gen, you can see that they were living the ultimate gaming experience. Marking material has been evolved. These guys, they were doing incredible VR on the i9 8th gen. But now they've given up VR and they've gone back to AAA gaming. As you see, a lot of things have changed between the 8th gen and the i9 9th gen. So over here, we got a new character. Before, he used to be a white dude. Now, he's a black dude. He's conquering the most demanding workloads. Look at that. And the black girl, she's gone. And I think she's still around, so you're still cool in there. So before you unleashing the power of your computing with the 8th gen, but now with the 9th gen, you're conquering the most demanding workloads. Oh, let's keep going. This lady, she's letting her creativity flow. Yeah, she's really staring at the screen and I think she's going to get some problems because she's been staring at the screen since the 8th generation. She was redefining enthusiast mobile PC performance back then. <laughs> so, so these guys are... This this lady over here, she's DJing. And you know when you ever DJ, you get in a trance. So you can see since the 8th gen, she's gone into the 9th gen still on that trance. <laughs> and they're talking about USB-C here. And over here they're talking about multitasking and security features to get out security features are the new thing with this knife knife generation edition obviously this lady is over here she's putting her asus into her backpack and uh, previously she's still putting the exact same laptop except they seem to have look at that they've done some photoshop they removed the asus logo <laughs> removed the asus logo <laughs> these guys are awesome all right, let's see what else has changed. I5, look at that. All right, the crux of the matter is some things have changed between 8th gen and 9th gen. And 9th gen now provides some logos. And most importantly, it gives you the mobile removed from chipset graphic. Check it out. Mobile. It's not mobile. It's all about a desktop. Intel have given up their mobile conquest. They pulled out of 5G because they realize it's dangerous for you health-wise. Don't know what we're doing with that. Honestly, but they've pulled out of mobile and they've gone straight into laptops. So the features of this 9th gen i9 processor is that it has eight cores. The problem is it runs slightly slower than the 8th gen. So previously we could go 2.9 gigahertz. Now we only go 2.3 because we have an extra two cores compared to the 8th gen. Now we can go up to 128 gigabytes of RAM. And uh, the bandwidth the same, ECC is not supported, we got the same exact graphics as before, although it says it's slightly faster, look at that, 120, 125, whoa, performance, the future is here, PCI is the same, peeing all over the place, you got T-junction over here, 100, you got T-junction is the same, the package is the same, it's not got any bigger, Optane still the same 2.0. Yes. Yes. Yes 64. Yes. 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 No Good good times over there. So the big big headlines is it's gone slower. It's gone from 2.9 to 2.4 But potentially it's faster because it's gone from six cores to eight cores graphics are the same Wi-Fi 6 sexy beautiful amazing the future is Amazing. Just if you want to see amazing CPUs, check out Tesla's new CPU. That one does uh, some Terra flapping action over there. But back to the mark. And I think the most important thing maybe with this uh, ninth gen is it's got uh, security features. Obviously, the eighth gen has security features, but if you're reading the news, Intel's been getting a lot of CPU hacks. So hopefully, they've fixed a few of them in the ninth gen. So that's it. The marketing review is over. We got MKB, we got gamers, you had a white guy, the white guy's gone, he's gone packing, he's got bad things to do. <laughs> They've gone rid of the white guy. <laughs> he looks too much like the, the Windows guy, and he's got a, his laptop's been photoshopped away. That was a Dell laptop, I think. 
and uh, everyone else has stayed the same. So that's your future, Knife Gen. The future is here. Desktop caliber performance on the go. Woohoo! Let me know what you think. I think it's fantastic. Unless you're a white guy with glasses, then you're you, you're out of luck. <laughs>